So I'm going to show you how you can use at font face with Axia RP. Now I recommend strongly against it to start off with. Um, but you know if you're absolutely determined to do it or you have to use it for some reason I will show you how to do it but it it can crash and not do good things. So anyway let's get started. First of all, let's find a font to download um, because I'll take you through the whole process just in case you haven't used that font face before. So let's go and find one that is quite obvious. It's a different font to the default Arial. Um, so let's have a look at maybe a display font. Here we go. Okay, let's get lobster. It'll be really obvious if all of our fonts change to lobster. So I click on the plus there. And see up here, I can download it. This is with the little download button. So we're downloading it. All is good. Now, um, so here is lobster. We've got lobster regular TTF. Let's go create. Um, our font kit. So if I go to font squirrel.com, this is where we can create a font kit for at font face using their font generator. So click on generator and we upload the fonts here. Uh, okay, let's go and find it. It was in downloads, lobster, lobster, TTF, choose. Um, you can choose basic, optimal or expert. I just always opt for optimal because that's the recommended settings. Make sure you have license to use it, okay? Do not go using copyrighted um, uh, fonts that you do not have license to use uh, because otherwise you could be sued for doing that. So let's download the kit. It is now downloaded. Um, so I'm just going to open it up here. Here we go. And what we have in here is we have a WAF and a WAF2. And they're the two fonts that we want to use. We also have a style sheet. Now I'm going to fire up Axia so that we can see how to add these. Thank you. 